JSTLC colon if code tag is used for executing a block of code on the basis of a test condition. Look at in the syntax. This C colon if opening tag is provided with a mandatory attribute that is test. And to this test attribute, we are simply providing here a condition. Uh, this condition is a Boolean condition. It evaluates to either true or false. If this condition evaluates to true, then the code block inside this uh, uh, C colon if opening and closing tag will get executed. Otherwise, if this condition even leads to false, then this uh, block of statement will be skipped. There is only one attribute available to C colon uh, if test tag, that is test. And this test attribute is provided with the test condition for C colon if tag. So let's dive into code. Here inside this JSTL example project, I have a file inside web content folder that is JSTL example.jsp. And in line number four, I am uh, using JSTL tag lib directive with URI attribute referring to JSTL core library. Using this prefix C, we will be able to use all the JSTL core tags inside this body. In body, I'm going to use a C set tag first. This C set tag has two attributes, that is var, and another one is value. I'm going to assign the variable age to this var attribute and the value to this age variable as maybe a numeric value that is 26. So what this C colon set tag will do, it will simply assign this 26 value to this variable age. After the C set tag, use your C colon if tag. Inside the C if opening tag, I'm going to use the mandatory attribute test and I'm going to assign here a test condition. So as part of test condition, I'm going to use L expression. And in this L expression, I'm going to pass a Boolean condition. That is age greater than or equal to 18. And then inside the body of C if tag, I'm going to use C out tag. And this C out tag will simply print the value as a message that is you are eligible for voting. And again, I'm going to copy this C if tag. And now this time, I'm going to change the boolean expression for this test uh, mandatory attribute as if age is less than 18. And then for this boolean condition inside the C if colon tag body, I'm going to change the message that you are not eligible for voting. Now let me uh, show you what this piece of code is going to do. First of all, the C set tag will simply set the value 26 inside this age variable. And this then this first occurrence of JSTLC if tag will simply test a boolean condition that whether the variable age that is set here 26 is greater than or equal to 18. In this particular case, the value inside age is 26 and 26 is greater than 18. So this boolean condition evaluates to true. Since this condition is true, so we will have your message C out uh, via this C out tag that is you are eligible for voting. Now. Let's have a look on this uh, C if tag. What is happening here? Since the test attribute evaluates to false here because age, the value of age is 26, that is not less than 18. So this particular statement will not get executed. So if I run this, I'm going to have this message. You are eligible for voting this time. Let's execute this file. Run as run on server. Okay. So you are eligible for voting. Now, if I go back to my code and change the value here less than 18, any number less than 18, then what is going to happen? Since this time the value of this age is set to 17, and from among these two C colon if JSTL tags, the first C colon if JSTL tag evaluates to false because the value of age is set to 17 this time, 
this boolean expression will evaluate to false so this c out will not execute but look here in the second instance of suggestion c if tag the test attribute evaluates to true because the value of age in, uh, right here is uh, 17 and 17 is less than 18 condition is true so this time this c out tag will simply print you are not eligible for voting so let's go ahead and refresh this page first of all save this page control s back to this page and i'm going to refresh this page this time look you are not eligible for